Hi, I'm Greg LeBlanc and I'm here at the Haas School of Business and I'm with Ashok Srivastava who is the Chief Data Scientist at Verizon. Welcome Ashok. Thank you so much. So Ashok, you're at Verizon, right, which is a, we think of it as a, as a legacy company, we think of it as uh, a telco that's, I mean it's been around since the breakup of AT&T and uh, is um, effectively a, a, a regulated utility, right, that's how we think of it. And yet, within uh, Verizon, you're responsible for what we would think of as a, as a startup uh, that is, you guys call uh, Exponent. Um, could you talk a little bit about what it's like to create a startup within a larger organization to tackle some of the new problems related to data science and artificial intelligence? Yeah, absolutely, Greg. First of all, thank you for having me here. It's great to be here. Um, it's an amazing experience. I have to say that uh, watching how a major corporation like Verizon comes together, decides on a new path, uh, an, an additive path to what they're already doing, and then they give the backing and the ability for people like myself to come in and then create new technology, new product lines, and also a new way of doing things, I think is, it has been an amazing experience from my perspective. Okay, and this new initiative is really all about figuring out new ways to, to monetize data, to utilize the massive amounts of data that uh, Verizon has, and, and ultimately to provide solutions for the wireless or telco industry in general, right? That's right. So the idea is that uh, the company is, is working in the areas that we all know, wireless, the wireline business, many other businesses. But one of the core capabilities that the company also has is in the area of technology. And in my area, in big data, artificial intelligence, and related platforms, what we're talking about is building the tools, the technologies, but most importantly, the product and platform to take data and to create it into data products that can be used by many other uh, uh, vendors for many different types of applications, ranging from advertising, which I think many people think of, marketing analytics, but then also in new areas, like in understanding Internet of Things, understanding drone technology, and many other areas. Right, and so do you think that there's an advantage that uh, wireless carriers might have in either the uh, kind of data that they have access to or uh, in their, based on their experience managing all of these data flows? I think one thing uh, that a carrier has is the scale that is often unprecedented. So tremendous scale in geographical terms, but then also tremendous scale in terms of the number of people, the number of transactions that come. When you take a look at all of these elements coming together, it's a very unique value proposition. To say that a carrier is uniquely positioned is, uh, is something that I would say is true with respect to certain uh, business lines. But the fact is that there are many companies out there that can and do operate in similar spaces. And so it's a very exciting time to be in a situation like this. Thank you, Ashok. Yeah.